Good evening, ladies and remaining gentlemen. Check out all of the highlights from Seth Meyers' opening Golden Globes monologue right here on Newsfeed. This episode is brought to you by TurboTax. Relax, there's TurboTax. Seth Meyers killed his opening monologue thanks to some help with his punchlines from some famous audience members. Seth Meyers did not hold back when it came to his opening monologue at tonight's Golden Globes, as the recent sexual harassment allegations across Hollywood and the hashtag MeToo movement took front and center of his intro to the awards show. He started off the night saying, quote, It's 2018 and marijuana is finally allowed and sexual harassment finally isn't. It's been years since a white man has been this nervous in Hollywood. When it came to mentioning what Seth called the elephant not in the room, AKA Harvey Weinstein, Seth joked, Harvey Weinstein is not here tonight. Don't worry, he'll be back in 20 years when he's the first person booed in the in memoriam. Things definitely took a lighter turn, however, when Seth joked about Meryl Streep and Steven Spielberg being nominated for The Post. Check it out. The Post is a film about journalistic integrity directed by Steven Spielberg and starring Tom Hanks and Meryl Streep. No, not yet. We have to wait. <laughs> we have to wait and see what happens. One part of Seth's monologue that also received a ton of laughs was his Jokes Seth Can't Tell segment, in which he provided the setup to a few jokes that stars in the audience then gave the punchline for. The Golden Globes turned 75 this year. But the actress that plays its wife is still only 32. <laughs> punchline, no setup, here we go. Said the peach in Call Me By Your Name, this scene is the pits. <laughs> Um, I'm officially casting my vote for Amy Poehler to start hosting literally everything again. Thank you. Please note that. Seth rounded up the monologue by acknowledging and congratulating all the amazing female nominees in the room, adding, quote, I look forward to you leading us into whatever comes next. Now that is a statement we can all get behind. So what did you guys think of Seth's opening monologue? Which jokes were your favorite and which ones just didn't land for you? Let me hear all of your thoughts in the comments and don't forget to subscribe for some more clever. Thank you so much for joining me on this edition of Trophy Life. I'm Zoe Lillian and I'll see you next time. Click to the left to see the most empowering quotes from the Golden Globes red carpet and to the right to see the best dressed stars of the night. This episode was brought to you by TurboTax. Relax, there's TurboTax.